Hi everyone, it's been a while since I've done a cooking video on here and I won't be long. I'm a hot mess. Uh, Brinley just went home and Miss Annie is sitting down there looking at me. But today, making Gerald's homemade chili, which you can tell this is a very used recipe. I need to look at that. It's just so old. Um, this is a recipe that he won with his partner fourth, I think it was fourth place, at a um, Oktoberfest in Gainesville so many years ago. The kids weren't too big. I know they remember it though because they entered the chicken contest anyway. Um, this is a chili that you do in layers, like you cook the first uh, the meat and then you add uh, a layer of spices, you stir that up and cook it for so long, then you add another layer of spices, cook it, another layer and cook it, and it is so good. And I'm making a big batch because I plan on um, freezing some, but I can have bowl of chili, I can have Frito pie, I can have enchiladas, ooh, and just so many things with this chili. So, I, um, you can see my mess on my kitchen, all of the stuff. There's the first layer cooking. And I'm putting the lid on it and cook it for 30 minutes and I'll come back and do more. I just wanted to say good, good Sunday morning. I hope everyone's having a very blessed day. It is Sunday, a day of rest, a day of reflection, a day of, um, <clears throat> the end of the week. I know a lot of people say it's the beginning of the week. It's really supposed to be a day of rest, so seventh day, a day of rest, and that's what I'm going to do after I make this chili. Anyway, I again, I hope everyone's having a very blessed day. I will um, come back and um, <coughs> show you some of the chili... Yeah, the marshmallows and chocolate doesn't go in here. We had s'mores last night. So, <clears throat> I will come back and show you the finished product later. I'll probably have a chili pie today. And I will come back on here and tell you how wonderful it tastes. Bye.